Hello everyone, this is Charlie and I'm back with another review video. I originally planned on making this video earlier over the weekend using the phone as I am uh, doing right now because my laptop actually uh, acted up and uh, I had a few issues. Um, this happened on, on Wednesday. My dad took it uh, to his office on Thursday so that the people in the systems would um, help resolve the problem. Fortunately, it wasn't anything serious, just some compatibility issues with the uh, antivirus. So they removed that and uh, yep, so I didn't lose anything. Like last time, if you recall, about a little over a year ago, uh, I had a few issues with my computer, uh, almost brand new, had lost the entire uh, hard drive and I had to uh, get a new one, uh, but this time it wasn't so serious. So I really didn't think I had any books, you know, last week, uh, so I wasn't, you know, the book you're seeing right now, I didn't have any intention of picking it up uh, until I read that it, some interesting things would be happening um, so I was somewhat interested and you know, I did learn that I had a book coming so I took the opportunity to uh, pick it up I haven't really been picking up Batman Superman in a while I dropped it after the second arc picked it up when it tied into Doomed uh, didn't pick up the arc after that, you know, the post-Doom arc. So, you know, I'm just usually, I wasn't really interested in that, but I'm interested in this issue. So, uh, I saw the preview on this on Monday, last Monday, uh, and I actually tweeted the fact that once again DC is doing this whole literal footnote on and actually you know indicating people to pick up books that haven't really come out and usually editorial footnotes uh, have the intention of uh, being a reference for events that have been referenced uh, in a book that you know occurred in previous issues so it, it is kind of frustrating uh, it does take me, it did take me out of the story for a little bit, uh, but besides that it was a, a good issue, I mean it was a very interesting issue, uh, a lot of things happened, uh, so first off, Superman goes to Gotham City and learns that Bruce Wayne is dead, in fact issue, pages, between pages 9 and 10 the whole 8 page preview occurred, uh, uh, he thinks Luthor uh, is behind his whole identity being uh, revealed um, but Luthor and this reminded me of John Burns Superman number two where um, Luthor learns uh, that Clark and the Superman and didn't believe it so here we actually get the same reaction from from Lex Luthor he doesn't believe Clark Kent is Superman and thinks he's putting him on uh, what else? Oh yeah, um, so in Gotham, he faces off against, you know, the Commissioner Gordon Batman. Um, he gets the, uh, he repaints a bat cycle, so now we got a super cycle. Uh, he has a conversation with Lewis. So yeah, a lot of interesting things happening here. This is a book that I actually learned I was I was getting from my uh, regular pull is Rachel Rising number thirty four. Another interesting issue. Uh, it's really hard to keep track of, of of what's going on because it takes what two months for every issue to come out, and I hardly ever reread it. Uh, but yeah, another fun, interesting, uh, funny issue. Uh, finally. Uh, Green Arrow, this is a back issue, Green Arrow number 2, 
this is the third volume though in my shop it's classified as the second volume but this is the the third volume that, that Kevin Smith uh, launched Green Arrow this issue uh, is number two like, like I mentioned and this is an issue I've been wanting for quite a while but I never really got a chance to see it uh, this is the first appearance of Mia Dearden so it's sort of a guess a minor key issue one that I've been wanting for like I said quite a while um, so yeah I'm glad I, I found it and in fact that show's got a, almost the entire uh, Kevin Smith run uh, issue one is missing uh, that's probably the only issue that's missing maybe a few more but yeah, great to have uh, found this, um, and you know I cannot get off my uh, want list. So uh, this is a quick video. Um, so I will see you next time with a pretty hefty haul. I hope uh, I'm pretty excited for the books coming out this week. Uh, looking really forward to the uh, Black Canary book. I'm actually picking up Press number one as well. I found it kind of interesting. The premise itself, the fact that the writer is saying that it's sort of uh, satire, so I love satire. Uh, but yeah, that's it for now. Until next time, keep smiling.